Spice is almost 10. She's gonna be 10 next month. She's a retriever Cross, who I got as a puppy when I was working and living in Dubai. Spice is very gentle, very loving. She's not got really an aggressive bone in her body. We're very in tune with each other's day-to-day -day activities. And um, if I'm off and having a lie-in, then she's quite happy to lie in. Even though she's gonna be 10 very shortly, she still has lots of energy. There's still times when she's just like a, a puppy. Vice was recently diagnosed with a heart condition. Unfortunately, it's a degenerative condition. And so she's not currently in heart failure, but that is a risk in the future. So she's on daily medication. When we first moved into the, this new house, it was in the summer. We had quite a long spell of warm weather and she was starting to pant more. The penny dropped when the weather started to cool down and the panting was getting worse. And then I decided it was time to investigate. She seems very well in herself. I'm pleased that it seems as if we picked up on the heart condition early on and I haven't really changed anything else with her lifestyle. I'm Fruin and I'm a vet and also a clinical director. Our ethos in our practice is to always treat the pet as we would treat our own pets and also to be very open and honest with the owner. I love helping animals, um, interacting with the clients, um, the challenge um, that patients bring and different cases bring, and also the variability in the day. No, no day is the same. I think being a pet owner, as well as a vet, helps me empathise. It can be quite difficult. Um, when your own dog is be, or cat is being treated, you're kind of putting yourself in the position that we're putting our clients in every day to trust us to do the job and get their pet better.